Truly, truly, tonight's party was hot and lit, but to be quite frank with all of you guys, Suj get mind no be here. Like the way Suj left Nelly where they were seated and went into the pool to be dancing with Onyeka erotically and be carrying Victoria in the pool. And it was even how Nelly was looking at him from where she was seated. I'm just like, wow, Suj get mind no be here. Like the way he is playing his own game. Guys, that guy now, Baba. Tonight party wasn't only hot, it was wild, it was erotic, it was something else. To be frank with all of you guys, these housemates, they actually gave us content upon content upon content upon content. Ah, to the extent that I was just like, wow. Wow. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are in for another interesting hot gist that I know you don't want to miss out from any part of it. Guys, what Toby Forge couldn't get with Cassia in that Big Brother Niger Season 9 mansion for almost three weeks, for almost four weeks, Seth, staying in Big Brother Niger Season 9 mansion, my good people of God, Femi David, Got it this night. Just watch. <laughs> Guys, the way Cassia rocked Femi David, it was hellele. Like the waistline was just moving and moving and moving and moving. But you know one beautiful thing about the rocking? She knew exactly when to draw the line. Like, could you all imagine that while she was rocking and grinding on Femi David, Femi David wanted to start grabbing. She immediately excused herself. And that quickly reminded me what her husband was telling her the other day that they had an argument. The husband said to her, the kind of play you play with these people will determine what they will do to you next. You see, she was grinding and rocking Femi David before you now know it. Femi David was seriously trying to grab something. Like, if not that she quickly and immediately excused herself she be if we cause kasala on social media you see it you see it well she was not the only one that rocked to and grind just take a pretty look at what her husband was doing with unika my good people of god tonight was helele the party was on fire Frankly, being married and playing Big Brother Niger game no easy at all. You really have to be using your Akonuche 100% because Omo is no easy. Small thing like this. Internet will cook you, roast you, dry you and throw away you outside like say tomorrow no day. Heli Ray, why doing that with Onyeka? Did not want to touch Onyeka like he opened his arm wide while his waist was busy doing what it was doing with Onyeka. Me, I'm just like, okay, well, being married and playing Big Brother Niger game is not for the weak at all. It's not for the forgetful people at all. Though. But so far, so good. I will still tell all of you guys that Kelly Ray and his wife, they are seriously doing this game. In fact, they are seriously trying their best because playing that game, no easy. And the way they are handling it is perfectly okay for now you know we still have several weeks to go let's keep watching let's keep praying let's keep hoping that they keep playing it the way they are playing it because if they in fact little mistake internet will not forgive them internet will roast them well away from that ladies and gentlemen we are in for another interesting hodges that i know you don't want to miss out from any part of if you are new to my channel kindly do it to subscribe to this channel click on the notification bell button and do not forget to like and share this video with your friends and loved ones that like big brother gist guys ozzy and victoria couldn't get enough of each other like today was for ozzy and victoria like the way ozzy was seriously marking his territory being all over victoria that's it. in fact at some point they were discussing and talking a whole lot of things i didn't know what they were talking about in fact i wanted to hear what they were talking about but i couldn't hear because of how loud the music was in fact the way onika avoided Ozzy, as Ozzy was seriously busy with Victoria. In fact, Ozzy was not even paying attention to Onyeka, but there was a time that I saw him um, dancing and gravitating towards Onyeka. After that, he still concentrated and was all his attention truly was on Victoria. When Victoria went to the pool to dance and, you know, swim, 
Guys, before you now know it, Ozzy that was putting on shirt, Ozzy that was on Nika, in fact, the Nika he was putting on is not a kind of Nika he can use to swim. He now have to go and change and put on proper bossa and went into the pool with Victoria. When he now went inside that pool with Victoria, guys, that was when Ozzy couldn't even hide his feelings at all for Victoria. We saw him carrying Victoria. We saw him doing a whole lot. Just take a pretty look at this particular video. I really need to show all of you guys. Like, honestly speaking, Ozzy couldn't hide again. He couldn't even pretend his feelings for Victoria. Like, the way he was all over Victoria, carrying Victoria, hugging Victoria, dancing with Victoria. Like, he did a whole lot of things. Guys, ever since I've been watching Pool Party, the kind of content that Ozzy created with Victoria today, I haven't even seen them done this much in any party at all with anybody. Not even with Onyeka. I haven't seen Ozzy doing something like that with Onyeka. Like, guys, uh, Ozzy couldn't hide his feelings, his love for Victoria. And at this point, I am here wondering, what will now happen to Ozzy's girlfriend outside the house? We should be impressed watching Ozzy doing all of this with Victoria in the house. Well, fingers crossed. So me, I'm going to actually see where this ship will lead Ozzy and Victoria to, although they are still in denial. But guys, their feelings for each other is way, way beyond denial. Anita and Tofa, the way these people we are kissing, they kissed and kissed and kissed and kissed and kissed. Do you all know that cameraman did not want to show us the kissing that happened between Tofa and Anita? It was from afar that we are seeing them. I don't know. Why cameraman, we are not zooming on them so that we'll be seeing it properly. And you know, as I have earlier told all of you guys, there is no any party that will happen in that house, be it pool party or Saturday night party, that Wani and Sean will not lick each other's tongue like there is no tomorrow. Like the way they don't even kiss, what they do is to lick and suck each other's tongue so every party in the house whether i tell all of you guys or i don't tell all of you guys just know for a fact that they actually did it because that is their routine ladies and gentlemen the people that actually entertained us to the fullest during this pool party we are cassia guys the way cassia was dancing having fun enjoying herself was out of this world honey and wandy i've been handy and wani guys you all know that those people their energy level their dancing skill everything is checked but i still wonder i still i still ask myself where does mickey belong in that big brother niger season nine honestly i don't know where he belongs Ben, we know that he is always gossiping every pool party, every Saturday night party. You must see him whispering. Like today, he whispered to Anita. He just pulled Anita aside. And he was whispering and whispering and whispering and whispering. What he was whispering, we did not hear it. We did not know what it was all about. At some point, he now met OC. That was how he still was whispering to him. After whispering to him, he met Tofa and he was still whispering to Tofa. So for Ben, we can boldly say that he gossips and whispers during any party in that house. Please, for Mickey, where do we place him? Because I can't find him anywhere. I cannot just find him anywhere at all. The, guys, this is where I'll be ending this particular video.